Hello, everyone, and welcome to the Indiana Gear Up YouTube channel. We're so excited that you joined us today. As Indiana Gear Up works to build capacity and resources and to be of support to our schools, teachers, parents, students, and community partners, we first want to let you know of ways in which we can connect. As you're joining us today on our YouTube channel at Indiana Gear Up, please subscribe to our page, share with your friends, family, any community members that may be interested in learning more about the resources or projects that we're working on uh, throughout the remainder of the year into the summer, professional development that we have, as well as preparing for next year. Uh, you can find us on social media platforms such as Facebook at Indiana Gear Up, Twitter at Indiana Gear Up, as well as Instagram at Indiana Gear Up. Also, you can reach out to us via email, indianagearup at purdue.edu. We have staff members behind the scenes who are readily available to answer any questions that you may have. Um, today, we'll be looking at how you connect with us on our website at indianagearup.org. And more specifically, our resource tab that's available for teachers right now. Um, we have an Indiana Gear Up COVID-19 resource folder that's available and it's free. This was developed um, by a seasoned expert of team, uh, a team of regional directors um, who have really just have an ample amount of experience in the education field. Uh, there are several documents here um, that you can browse through and use at your leisure. Uh, today, more specifically, we're gonna be taking a look at the Gear Up Educational website resources. And each day we're going to be sharing a tutorial on one of these websites that is specific to the subject for the high school level, the link that is available, the description, as well as the services that are currently offered. Again, we hope that, that this can be of use to you now or in the near future for teachers, uh, staff members, parents, um, or community members. So enjoy. Hello everyone, this is Stacy Kitchen with Indiana Gear Up and we wanted to share another great resource with you. I really love this resource. The acronym is CLEAN, and what it means is that is the Climate and Energy Awareness Network. So when you enter this, you're gonna find that there are over 700 free online peer-reviewed resources, and they are aligned to, aligned to the next generation science standards. Uh, they're ready to use resources, and it's free, Free all the time, always free. It is basically um, resources from third grade to higher education. There are a few, a couple that I found like K12 resources, but for the most part, you're gonna wanna look for um, anything above third grade level. So as you enter, you can see that uh, you can browse by collection, you can browse by next generation science standards and different ways to search. So I went through the browse by collection. So as I went in, I was looking down through the different collections. Um, and as you look over here, you have different, you can go by resource types. So you have activities, you have demonstrations, lab experience, uh, experiments you can do, uh, teaching guidance, videos. Um, it can go by grade level. So you can see pri primary K to two, there's one. Uh, intermediate, intermediate three to five, there's 25. But as you get into middle school, high school, there's a lot of matches there. Uh, this is now by the Next Generation Science Standard Science Standard Expectations, the Core Ideas, the Cutting Concepts, and the Engineering and Science Practices. Um, or you can do by regional fo focus. If you're a social studies teacher and you want to go more to the regional focus of some place that you're talking about. Um, but anyway, as you're going through, you can see all these different collections. And I went, as I was looking through, when I got to page three of the five, actually seven, um, I saw this Earth Day, 1970 to 2017, what has changed? Well, that perked my interest. So as I opened it, I found there's a nice video here. The length is only three minutes and 57 seconds. I would highly encourage you to watch it. I found it to be very well done. I'm gonna play just a couple seconds of it so you can see the video quality and the sound which is very well done. But as you can see, there's also a transcript 
So for those students who don't have internet connection and you want to send the transcript so that they know what is being said in the video so that it can start the topic of conversation, you have the transcript here as well. So that's just a taste of what the video uh, quality is. And again, you know, because there's no one speaking in the video, if you need the transcript as well for someone uh, to help read it to them, um, if they are struggling readers, it can be used in that way too. Um, so view more climate videos down here. Anyway, I found that one to be really great. I do enjoy this uh, website a lot, and I hope you take the time to look through it. Um, there are lab demonstrations in it. There are, um, they're easily searchable. Uh, it does include activities as well. So I hope that um, not only that, there are professional development webinars on here. And there's a toolkit that's going to help you as an educator uh, take this climate info and put it into an online classroom. So there's everything here. It is um, you're going to find that it uh, is with all the social media uh, areas. You can find it on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. That all of these um, companies here are a part of putting this together. So it is highly vetted, peer reviewed, and always free. Always free. So take the time to look at it. Have a great day.